Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel HGSB Builder once more again. So if you're watching my video for the first time, then don't forget to subscribe my channel. So in this video, I'll be guiding you how to connect your domain to your AA panel. So it's going to be very easy. We have to follow my steps, okay? And uh, if your domain is successfully connected, then don't forget to subscribe my channel. Okay, so make sure you have already purchased a domain from any server, no matters. Uh, from where you have purchased a domain. So I have purchased the domain from Hostinger. If you have purchased the domain from uh, any other platform, then you have to just follow my steps. Okay, guys. Trust me, it's very easy. So I want to connect this domain. So go to the manage option. If you are using uh, any other platform, you will get the same options. Okay. I have gone to the manage option, domain manage. Then come to DNS name server. Okay, guys. DNS name server. And after that, you have to go back to your AA panel. So in this video, we will connecting our domain to our AA panel. It's very easy. You just have to copy the IP of your AA panel, which is at the left top corner of your AA panel. Just copy this IP, guys. Okay. Just copy this IP and uh, come back to your domain provider platform and uh, we have to add a new DNS record so make sure uh, the type is type A the name is at the rate and points to the IP you have to put the IP and just add your record uh, you have to just do this guys okay type A and name at the rate points to and this and just add the record guys okay and you have to just add it add record and it will be added okay so this is how you can connect your domain to double another method go back to double panel come to app store and you have to install a plugin name dns manager dns just search for dns uh, wait a minute for all and search for dns huh? You will get this DNS manager option, guys. Okay, DNS manager option. You have to install this. And after installing, you have to follow my steps. Uh, once it is installed, go to your install plugin option. Let me refresh my site. Yeah, I think it is not installed yet. Let's check once more again. DNS, DNS, and search for this. Yeah, DNS manager installing. Okay, guys. Yeah, it will taking it will take some time to install this plugin. And after installing DNS uh, manager, uh, we will require our name server names. Okay, so you can uh, check uh, your name servers at the child names servers. Here we will get the child name servers, and we can also change the name server, guys. Okay, DNS forwarding, DNS record. Yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here only we'll get, we are getting the option DNS name server. If you want to change the name server, then you can go here at child name server. You can change the child name server. Sorry, the name server. You can change the you can change the name server. Okay. So this is our name server too. If you are using any other platform, it will be uh, something else. Okay. So let copy this. Control C. Go back to double panel and it is successfully installed our dns manager has successfully installed guys okay again go to install option and now we have to do it setting okay guys so in our dns manager we will have, uh, we will be adding our new domain so add a domain you have to put your domain so this is my domain let's come back here domain overview just copy this control c and paste your domain here the domain ip uh, so this is our ip okay guys so this is the ip at the left top corner okay let me copy this uh, copied now go to the setting option and uh, uh, we have to add a new domain add a new domain first domain ip and uh, let me copy my domain control c control v now you have to copy the name server go back to dns name server copy the your name server and uh, paste it here okay again in name server you can paste it and uh, in a second one you can uh, paste this okay so second one ns2 uh, don't worry guys uh, in, if you are using some any other platform, uh, uh, 
the domain name servers might be different okay so let's confirm, confirm this so adding domain name please wait so it's done now come to default ns and here also we have to add our name servers control c control v and the second name server control c and control v and you have to save this guys okay so i have tell you two steps uh, how to connect your uh, uh, domain to double panel i hope this video was uh, helpful for you so make sure you are subscribing my channel so thank you guys for your support and for watching my video thank you